Hello everybody and welcome back to part 15 of this Follow New Vegas walkthrough. This is also part 2 of this Honest Hearts DLC. So we just finished off getting supplies from Ranger Station, the General Store, and some of the old world uh, buildings and stuff. So now we gotta bring supplies to Daniel in the Narrows. Where's that at? All the way up top, okay. What is that? Ranger Substation Osprey. Is that a plane? Or is that a helicopter, I think? That's, an, that's what an Osprey is, right? I'm gonna find out. Oh, it's just a ranger station. Okay. That makes more sense. What is in here? I'll take it. Oh, my confusion. Park Ranger hat. Okay. Well, let's stop getting distracted. Let's head to Daniel in the Narrows. Is this a drop off? Please don't be a drop off. I'm getting tired of drop offs. That Back when medicine smells funny. Guess it works though. Oh, please don't be a cliff. That is a cliff. How do I get down from here? Okay, let's put the gun away. What does that mean? Senses are already heightened by this grand vista. I don't know what that means. Let's go back down to water level. Or close to it. And we'll go towards the water. Follow the stream up that way. The river, whatever. Oh, that's a tree. Oh, it's just a rad scorpion. Wondering what that uh, enemy mark on the minimap was. Are you shooting at that? Uh oh. What in the world is going on here? Is this from way earlier? The same guy is still fighting? Oh, he did have a 45 auto. I'll take that. Whoa. Here we go. Oh, I'm over encumbered, really. I've seen him using these clubs. What are they? Oh, that's a dead horse, dude. My bad. I couldn't save you, my guy. That's not worth it. Okay. Let me get this some machine gun repaired. Anything else I can repair? I'm gonna hold that to sell it, so... Wait, did Shish Kebab just using it lose you health? That's crazy. Let's 
Survival plus five, perception plus one. It looks awesome. I'm gonna hold on to it. Let's get rid of the other stuff, though. Okay, let's actually head towards the Narrows. Yeah, this police pistol's pretty good. The spitter plants and the green monster men aren't native to Zion. Wonder where they came from. So, dead money was worth it just for uh, the money. Because you, you can cash out a lot of caps if you play blackjack. Especially of a luck build. Because I did the save and exit way of playing blackjack in the uh, Sierra Madre Casino. But that took about two hours off camera of just playing blackjack, save, reload. But if you have a luck build... Like, maxed out luck. It'd be way easier. Probably way more fun, too. Where you can just hit pretty much on every... <laughs> just keep on hitting. But... What the heck is... Oh, it's just a gecko. Here we go. Never stood a chance, did they? But it's... The money you can get out and the uh, the guns, because the freaking police pistol's been like, honestly one of the best, consistently good guns that I've used so far. I don't know if I, I just can't hit shots good enough, but a lot of these other guns are just not super effective all the time. It's it, I'm gonna be honest. It's probably more that I just can't hit shots worth the crap in this game. Just Xander roots. So uh, Joshua Graham sounds like the, the way, from the way he talks the about everything. Ahead. That's the sorrows territory. They're peaceful enough, but you don't want to make them mad. It sounds like Joshua Graham wants to wipe out all the tribals, though, compared to potentially this guy. I don't think he really wants to fight with people. Comparatively, at least. Are you trying to come talk to me? Because I'm a... You are the one Joshua Graham sent to us. Blessings of the father in the cave on you. Daniel is waiting for you. I like your bear glove. Where can I get one? A sorrow's Yaogwai fist is a sacred symbol. It shows that we belong to the tribe and have willingly undertaken a dangerous quest to aid the tribe. Each sorrow makes his own, and only after hunting and slaying a Yao Guai that threatened our people. Our shaman, White Bird, oversees the rites. Perhaps if you spoke to him, he would allow you to undertake such a quest. Okay, I'm definitely doing that. I don't know if I need to do it right this second, but it's definitely happened. I know that. I'm getting a freaking <laughs> I'm getting a freaking uh, Yaogwai fist. At Sweet Flower Cave. Let's discover all these points. Is there anything even up here? Oh, Sorrow's Camp. Oh, that was a mistake. Let's not do that. Anything else back here? Let me take some, like, uh, some eight items here. I 
Oh, I can't get that from down here. Is there, is there anything even back here? It's freaking cool aesthetic though, I'll tell you that. Oh, are you Daniel? Crossroad Cavern. Okay. Make a save right before a big dialogue here. Get up, Daniel. The dead horse has told me details about the attack on your caravan. A stranger's sympathy might not count for much, but for what it's worth, I'm sorry. The Appreciate sorrows it. will mourn your friends, too. They mourn everyone, even the white legs. They have sensitive souls. Innocent, if there is such a thing. In spite of what's happened, I hope that Joshua and I can help you out of here. But to be frank, we need your help, too. Uh, Joshua told me you needed a few things. I think this is everything. Well, I'll be. I was starting to lose hope we'd be able to get any of this, much less all of it. Tribals are smart, but, well, they're ignorant. <sighs> Letting go of a taboo is difficult for them. So I knew it would have to be one of us. Turns out all it took was a Gentile, or, uh, no offense. Not taken. These supplies are a godsend. But if we're going to evacuate Zion without drawing more white leg attention, I need you to go back into the valley. I'm going back there anyways. I need you to scout out some locations for white legs and try to recover a map of Grand Staircase, a wilderness area to the east. There's also the matter of the roads. We're going to be heading out of the east side of the park, but I'm not sure the way is clear. Anything to help, I'll do what I can. I appreciate the enthusiasm. There aren't a lot of people in the wasteland with kindness to spare for anyone who isn't kin. Since you've been poking around the valley, you might see more activity from the White Legs. One of the Sorrow's hunters, Waking Cloud, has volunteered to help guide you through the valley. She has a special talent for staying out of sight. After this, it's just a matter of getting everyone out of here safe and sound. And hopefully, you can head back to the Mojave without any more trouble. Well, here we part ways. Oh, dang I need it. You back at the dead horse's camp. Maybe I'll see you there sometime. Okay, well. Uh, let me try out Walking Cloud. Give my regards, Joshua. Good going, Akis. Okay. So let's see here. I got a couple quests now. I'm going to do uh, White Bird Shaman. And I'm going to talk to Walking Cloud. Waking Cloud is her name. Sorry. <laughs> I'm going to do that. I'm going to do all these. Where is the... Uh, I need to talk to the shaman. Is he in... White Bird's cave. Oh, White Bird's the shaman. Okay. Shaman dude, where you at? Are you him? Hola, outsider. Welcome, child of omens. You come to receive visions of truth? Take drugs, kill a bear. Seek medicine <laughs> plant. Return with sacred datura root. Receive visions of truth. They guide you. Okay, then. I, I guess I'll just go, then. Go. Return, maybe yes. Return, maybe no. But go. Okay, he's tripping out on some strong drugs. And he's I guess he's trying to get me to take those same drugs. Are they in the camp? Like What is this way? Crossroad Cavern. Pull out a gun just in case. Yep.
Oh, you're a little pup. I feel so bad about this. I'm so sorry. Dang, I don't mean to feel bad for, for animals in a Fallout universe, but geez. I'll just go into Zion Canyon. I don't want to go that way. I want to... I need to go find Waking Cloud and... It's not what I needed to do. So I got some fast travel points, so once I talk to everybody, I'll just fast travel a little further down in the map. Out of the Narrows. Okay. Best way out of here. So I know I don't necessarily need my Vault 13 Canteen. It's mostly for um, when you're playing Hardcore. You see even where I'm going? Oh, that's... Thank God that that was deep water. Because I was just about to die right there. Wow, that was close. <laughs> I need to actually watch where I'm going. So is Waking Cloud right by the exit? Or the entrance to the Narrows? Whatever. Yeah, there she is. Daniel said that I was to travel with you until you have completed your scouting. Is this pleasing to you? Yes. Certainly. So it's easier to sneak by, but I don't I don't really want to sneak by, I'm gonna be honest. I wanna fight everybody and kill them all. They always attack first, so I'ma wipe them out. Okay, why are you constantly just like Every time I turn a corner, that dude's there just looking like he's about to start a fight. I don't like it. Now, how do I get all the way up there? Do I need to go further in this cave? Well, that might be it. Mole rats. You leave me no choice. You leave me no choice. I have this under control. So she's a melee fighter, I guess. Like Veronica, but tribal. This doesn't even lead to anything, does it? And I wouldn't leave like a mole rat den right next to your your base, man. I don't know how that's smart. Okay, let's exit out here again. How do you get up there? I did it again. There must be a way from up here. There just has to be. Did I just go the wrong way when I came through here? I might have. Because I went that way, I think. Did I? White leg attacks grow more frequent each day. I fear for our people and for our valley if something is not done. Maybe I do need to go that way. Oh, 
Oh. Are these rock pathways leading to it? Okay, now I can maybe actually, uh... Get to some of these other locations. Half mouse cave. So does it actually need me to go in these caves? Maybe that's the sacred deterra route. And I'm just... Going to the wrong place over and over. Oh, dropping down. Hey, I didn't lose health that time. There. So I got him discovered. Why can't I fast travel from here? Oh, that's gonna fall to my death. Really? Protect us, your humble children, as we labor in the vineyard. There's sacred deterra root. Two more, and I can go fight a Yaogwai. This place is confusing. I'm gonna be honest. It's pretty annoying trying to find your way around here. One more. Because I was over here just a couple minutes ago. And it was not showing these, uh, waypoints. I went through the cave that led back to the same spot I'm in now. And now it's... And now it's showing waypoints. Are y'all, like, not aggro geckos? Return to the Shaman. White Rose Cave or something like that. Crossroads Cavern. I knew that. Wait, no. This is oh, it's taking me back to <laughs> the Upper Narrows again, isn't it? God. Gotta make this place so freaking confusing all the time. Exit that cave right into another cave. 
White bird. That's it. I got your deter root. Give me some drugs, I guess. So I can go uh, trip out and kill a bear. You have root of sacred datura? Yes. These roots made sacred vision tea. Sure. Drink. Tea is strong. You go to cave. Find ghost of she. Lay ghost to rest. This your quest. Bring peace where was strife. Go. Wow. Okay. Retrieve the bar the paw from the ghost of she. Now can I fast travel? Nope, of course not. So where's Crossroads Cavern? So I can exit out of here a little quicker. I wish you could have met my family. You would like them, I think. Dead Horse Tribal. Is he... Is he over with the sorrows? Am I going the right way? Yeah, it looks like it. We just find a safe spot to drop down somewhere here. The fun way. Get out of here and go fight a bear. This is why I don't use drugs in this game. is because it always messes up the visuals. And I don't like the look of it when it's like fuzzy. It's already an older game. Why are you over here? By the here? rivers of Babylon, there we sat down. Yea, we wept when we remembered Zion. Remember, O Lord, the children of Edom in the day of Jerusalem, who said, Raise it, raise it even to the foundation. O daughter of Babylon, who ought to be destroyed, happy shall he be that rewardeth thee as thou hast served us. Happy shall he be that taketh and dasheth thy little ones against the stones. Do you know what it means? <laughs> no, I don't know what this is. Oh, you don't want to leave Zion. You'd rather kill every last one of the white legs. Given those two choices, yes. In the best of all possible worlds, they would just leave us in peace. But they won't. I don't enjoy killing. But when done righteously, it's just a chore. Like any other. Practiced hands make for short work. And the good Lord knows there's much to be done here. I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to call them human garbage, but they're tribals and raiders. Happy are those who do the work of the Lord. Zion belongs to God and the people of God. It is a natural temple and monument to his glory. It's pretty beautiful. When our Lord entered the temple and found it polluted by money changers and beasts, did he ask them to leave? Did he cry? Did he simply walk away? No. He drove them out. It is one thing to forgive a slap across my cheek, but an insult to the Lord requires... No. It demands correction. I mean, I kind of agree. I and the dead horses are prepared to do what must be done to protect Zion from the White Legs. And though Daniel won't accept it yet, there are many sorrows who are also prepared. They may not be warriors, but this is their home. If you have a chance to speak with Daniel about this, ask him to consider defending Zion instead of abandoning it. He has good intentions, but I fear that if we evacuate the sorrows from this place, it will be lost to them and us forever. I mean, yeah, I'd agree. I'd defend this place. If I was in charge, I, I'd probably be starting uh, wiping them out. I mean, they're pretty much just raiders. They they start fights. I've not shot first. I don't think in any of these engagements so far. So, I would agree. I'd probably try to wipe them out. Don't evict yourself. Evict them. So, where how far over is this? Is? Oh, it's all the way around there. 
the heck is this waypoint? Well, I'm definitely going to help Joshua because he's a straight badass. So, either way, I'm following him. Daniel seems like a good leader. But not exactly what I want to follow. Much further. Coming up around here. Oh, yep. Look where, I, look where I'm going. You leave me no choice. Freaking giant Cazador. I need help. Oh, shut up. That should keep me going a while. I hate Cazadors. Did I go too far? Or I gotta make my way up there somehow. I think I gotta go further to make my way up. Maybe. What's here? Seems like it'll lead to it. I'm gonna pull out a different gun though. We're gonna pull out... Sleepy time. My silent submachine. Is that freaking plants? Spitting at me? You better stop spitting at me. And a freaking Cazador as well. Yeah, I like this. And I leveled up. Okay, what am I at? Get medicine up to 40 for now. Um, speech is at 85. Put that at the 90, because if I ever need a speech check, I could just use a book. White leg attacks grow more frequent each day. I fear for our people and for our valley if something is not done. See, she's agree she agrees. Is that Here a Yagwai? Well, that's just a cub. Yeah, I like sleepy time. Freaking pretty fun. Are y'all all a bunch of y'all guys? Hey. Getting close to dying here. Chill out. Yeah, I'm in love with this thing. This was a good purchase with the uh, pre-war money that I got from so from dead money. This was definitely worth it. This is the ghost of She's Lair. I was never brave enough to try to find. Oh, what the heck! Oh my God! That's a flaming Yaguai. Wow. 
this place. Is that because of Wild Wasteland? I think that's because of uh, Wild Wasteland. Now, can I please fast travel to the shaman? Yes. Thank you. Does ghost of she like quiet in grave? It's done. Then visions of truth are at an end. Will you learn from truth? Maybe yes, maybe no. Only for you to decide. Here, take. Gift to remind you of visions. Use well. Or sell to cure your traitor. Either way, says much about you. Dang. That was actually good at, uh, a good lesson there. So can I fast travel? Like, what quest do I need? I'm gonna do the Yao Guai quest first. These are all down here, so... Is East, East Fork Bridge is the closest? Oh, so I have to collapse that cave, so I'll fast travel to that one. Right? Yao Guai. Even our strongest hunters could not hope to kill so many. There must be a nest nearby. What do you propose? Fighting so many at once is a dangerous prospect, unless you are a truly mighty warrior. This many so close together suggests a nest nearby. If we find it and destroy it, we might have better luck. Did Daniel not give you some of the new Canaanites' fire clay? That could easily collapse a cave and trap the beasts inside. Look around and see if you can find a cave nearby. It may prove easier than slaying the beasts. I hope that is truth and not a boast. But I will respect your leadership. I stand with you. So do I collapse it or... What does it say to do? Those are mines. Mining detonator. Giant freaking geckos. Is that enough for y'all or there's one more? Air. Freaking blowing through ammo for this <laughs> submachine gun. Let me grab the police pistol back out. So can I collapse this thing or not? Where are they? We're going in here. This is optional. If I if I could just kill them all, can I just Oh, at key points within the cave. Oh, so they're they're none of them are right here. Okay. That's a big cave.
There's one. I have a rebreather. Attacks grow more frequent each day. Oh, I shut up. For our people. I'm in a cave. I'm trying to sneak around here. Shut up. Done. Nothing back here? Get out of the way. Okay, so that's that way. That leads down to the water. What's this way? I got any loot here or something? Nothing? Okay, let's head back the way I came. So it says mining detonator. There's that one. Wait, were all the other locations optional? Really? There's still a bunch more Yagwais. That bridge is right there. Why did I fast travel that? You can nikumpa me. This one is mine. I can't. You can know Ninkumpa me. Okay, let me uh pull out some better weapons here. This trail bar I suck at hitting shots with trail carbines. She unconscious get up fights over now she's embrace this is not the most pleasant place I've woken up <laughs> okay fair enough come at me Hey, come back here. Bone breaker. We're fighting. Are you scared of me? Stop running away. You can know Ninkupa me. Did they he did he drug me?
Whatever. Let me just take a stim pack or something here. Grab a different weapon. I'm a little woozy. I hope I don't like pass out all of a sudden. Where do you What the heck is that? Oh, that is a horrible vision. You leave me no Yeah, I don't, I don't know if I, oh my god, stop it, please. What is like, what is that vision? That's horrible. Please knock it off. I'm getting real tired of this thing. Okay, I'm about to like pass out or something. There has to be a reason this is happening to my vision. Oh, freaking go to the freaking menu. Jeez. Yield. This sucks. I leveled up that quick? Okay. I'll bring science up to 90 as well. And put... 10 points. Well, I'll bring lockpick up to 90. Medicine up to 45. What's shotgun surgeon? I've been using shotguns. Let me hold on to that for now. Let's see what else they have. Yeah, I'm gonna go shotgun surge, and I've been using that a lot. Let me see what other weapons y'all have. That's a trail carbine. Yeah, I'll repair that. How much further away are these other ones? Oh yeah, they're way over there. I'll go to the spine here. Let's probably go up here and go that way. Oh, wrong way. Go across the bridge and take a left. Is that a freaking plane sticking out, or is that a rock? Are you serious? When salt upon wounds took New Canaan, he ordered the white legs to salt the earth so nothing could grow again. What kind of monster could do that? Oh, crap. 
Crap, 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 crap. Cazadors. My most hated enemy. Hey, can the, the coyote fight the Cazador? He's not gonna win, but can you distract him? Oh. Oh, thank God I have a companion. Even my best friends won't work if I'm dead. I oh, need help. Give me a second. You're, you're full health. The heck is wrong with you? Patriarch's campground. Did that freaking Cazador take out the geckos? It looks like it did. You leave me no choice. Take another uh, 45 auto some machine gun. I'll take them all and all the ammo I can get. I'm enjoying the 45 autos. It, it just looks like one of my favorite, like, aesthetic guns in history. Just the Thompson submachine gun, it looks beautiful to me. Is this another, uh, white legs? I don't think so. Oh, let's go past then. Court Fork Overlook. That's a pup that way, so there must be another coyote here. Gecko. White legs, crap. You know what? Let's do this the fun way. You leave me no choice. Day are you? That's what you get. Do you only have the mantis? Where are you at? Suck it. Oh, you're glitched in place. This is why I have grenade launchers. Zion used to be a place of peace, you know. Daniel says that it is holy in the eyes of the Father. I hope someday you will see it as it was. Oh, oh yeah, Big Horner Camp. That makes sense. Well, let me uh, grab my grenade launcher again, and I'll just start lobbing grenades down there. Get him, Waking Cloud. I can't keep up. Even my best Arabs won't work if I'm dead. I need help. You. Oh, God. I didn't realize I was literally a second away from dying. Now get up. Hunting revolver. I've wanted one of those. What the heck is that? Is that a Yagwai? So 
So I gotta take their totems, don't I? War totem. I'll take it. Those tents down there. That is a white leg war camp. Do you see the war totems they've erected around the tents? What? Good to know. Yes. If their war totems were to disappear, they would likely lose the will to fight. I will. So I didn't have to kill them, is what you're saying. That's what you're. Now, of all times, after I've killed them all, now you're saying if I just steal them, they may lose the will to fight. You, you could have said that before I slaughtered a bunch of people. I appreciate that very much. Beforehand, of course. Because I have stealth boys for a reason. I could have just booked it this, light, this way like I'm about to do. That most people outside the valley do not keep to the father's ways. Oh, shut up. Leave, you will carry his word with you. Looks like he still had the will to fight. So did he. Do you have the will to fight? Yeah, he had the will to fight. Sadly, he had the will. Okay. Now what's the last place? Find a map of the Grand Staircase region. Put the gun away. Where is this at? I'm gonna go to Patriarch's campground here. Really? Is it? Did more y'all spawn in? You know what? I'm just gonna go to the, the point. Cause I'm gonna wipe out wipe out these white legs eventually. Cause it seems like they still have the will to fight when I uh when I take away their totems. So we're just gonna destroy them all. Don't see any traps. Oh, it's freaking plants again. I know shotguns aren't meant for long range, but it's what I have, it's what I'm gonna use. How you like that? Where do I go here? There's a lantern in this cave, so... Oh, can I just come up here? Oh, that makes sense. Who lived here? Jeez. Who lived here?
O oh, Father, guide and protect us, your humble children, as we labor in the vineyards, and make us strong to resist those who would steal Zion from us. Okay, let's get out of here. I think we go back to the Narrows now. Really? Oh, he already got him. Okay. Go back up to... White Bird's Cave. Where you at, Daniel? Daniel son. Is he sleeping in here? Really? Okay, you're just gonna take me back out to the Narrows. Thank you for this. I'm glad to see you're still with us. How can I help you? Why are you so eager to evacuate Zion? You don't seem to be a pacifist. There's an old saying that goes, If you want peace, get ready for war. You've got me figured half right. I'll shoot dead any white leg that tries to creep into this camp. But it's only to protect the sorrows. The Lord helps those who help themselves. But the sorrows don't know how. Joshua and I do. Since I got them into this mess, I need to get them out. If you're willing to defend the Sorrows, why not pursue the White Legs? There is an important difference between killing in defense and waging war. Even a Gentile like you should know that. Yeah, he's a new Canaanite. Joshua is a living Bible of all mankind's miseries of war. <laughs> the debt he has levied through his actions, he repays every day. He is a monument both to God's unending forgiveness and to humanity's unfathomable capacity for cruelty. It's written on every inch of his body. When you look at him, do you only see a man of God? Beneath those bandages, he is burned flesh. As he burns, so does he consume everyone around him. Joshua wants to fight because the white legs have stoked the naked flame inside of him. You, you see the light but do not yet feel the heat. I can pray that you never will, but it isn't up to me, and it isn't up to God. It's up to Joshua. Yeah, what do you know about the father in the caves? Father in the... Oh, right. He's some spirit the Sorrows used to believe in. Watched over them from the caves in the valley. They marked some of the caves around here because they think they'll be punished for going inside. I think as more of them learn the teachings of the new Canaanites, they'll lose their old superstitions. Oh? Oh. <sighs> of course. How stupid of me. They probably also think Mary is the mother and Jesus is the child. No wonder they picked up on things so easily. I guess it just goes to show how difficult it is to communicate sometimes. I appreciate it. Well, that's it. This is all we need. Now all that's left is to quietly pack up and try to get out of here without being noticed. That's assuming that Joshua won't try to stop me. And that he hasn't talked you into fighting the White Legs despite what I've said. Don't worry, I don't hold it against you. You're a... an outsider. Fighting seems like the practical solution. I'll tell you again. There's more at stake. Whether you decide whether the Sorrows should flight, fight or flee, your decision will set their destiny irre irrevocably in motion. 
You will be unable to finish any remaining quests in Zion once you make your decision, so choose wisely. I need Even to think about this. Doubts. Think it over, but listen to your heart. And do it quickly. We don't have much time. Level up again. I'm leveling up pretty quick this time. So I'm at 90 all the way across. Medicine, I'll put that up to 50. What else should I go? Guns, I kind of want to put up to 80. Yeah, I could put this up to 80. And then barter up to 50. Okay, let me make a save. Before I make any decisions. But for now, this is actually where I'm going to uh, call it quits for this part. Part 2 of the Honest Hearts and part 15 of this full Fallout New Vegas walkthrough. So next time, I guess, I don't think I have any other missions to do in the... Oh, I need to talk to Joshua Graham. I'll probably do that first. So I'll, I'll fast travel there next time and talk to see if I can get Follows Chalk to come out with me to the Mojave Wasteland. But then we'll carry on and decide whether we fight the White Legs or just let these guys escape. I think you should fight, but that's my opinion. So we'll I'll see you on the next part where we take off from there. Take care.